honor. Guess what? It's day 200. Hallelujah. Can you believe we already made it to day 200? I cannot believe how fast time's going by. So why not have a giveaway today? I'm giving away one of my four in one machine quilting rulers. If you already have one, well, here's your chance to win a spare. <laughs> Just leave a comment and tell us what is your favorite Christmas tradition? We'll select a winner and announce it tomorrow in the description. We'll post the winner there and also notify you. So just let us know. Anyways, today we're going to be stitching using the 4-in-1 Machine Quilting Ruler. Let's get stitching! I'll start out by using my blue Mark Be Gone marker and marking a T through the center of my quilt block. From there, I'm ready to begin stitching. I'll begin stitching at the bottom marked point. From there, I'm going to stitch a curved line using the largest curve on the 4-in-1 machine quilting ruler up to the top. From there, I'll move my ruler over a quarter of an inch, stitch along the ditch, moving over just the width of my ruler foot, and then I'll stitch back down to the bottom. From there, I'll repeat this one more time, stitching a total of three lines. After I've stitched those three lines, then I'm going to move to the opposite side of that marked line and repeat that same process. After I've stitched the three lines, then I'm going to stitch along the ditch, moving up to the marked point on the right side of the block. When I get to that marked point, then I'm going to again stitch three lines, moving from right to left, left to right, and again right to left. When I I'm done stitching my third line, then I'll adjust my ruler and stitch three more lines, this time on the bottom side of that marked line, working back and forth. After I've completed all three of those lines, then I'll finish this design by stitching in the ditch all the way around the outside of the block and spritzing away those marked lines. I hope you enjoyed today's block and found a little bit of inspiration with my machine quilting. Now just remember, you can pick up the panel, the rulers, the thread, all of the notions that I'm using in this video today over on my website, peaceandquilt.com. And don't forget to share your progress pictures over on Instagram using the hashtag Let's Stitch with Natalia. That's where we will be selecting winners for weekly prizes. See you all tomorrow. Thank you.